Hey guys, it's Sally from Vintage Discovery with another bag haul, vintage, mostly, hopefully, jewelry, bag, unbagging. Sorry, that was wrong. Yeah, took me a while, but had to get some supplies back in. Uh-oh. And, uh... Feeling pretty good about it. This is nice. Trafari. Made in the USA. In the Avon box. Oh. Cute little set. Ooh. Has the old little spongy thing. They don't make them like they used to. That's nice to have all the original stuff. And these are cute. I like these. So this doesn't appear to be silver though. Let's see the copper coming through, but could be, could be that just, this was replaced maybe, but it's not, more, it's not marked, I don't think, I'm not sure if it's real turquoise. Hmm. It's nice anyway. I would wear it. Pretty. A little bead. Looks like it belongs to something else, of course. One of these handmade rings with the uh, tiger's eye heart. That's cute. Mm -hmm. It's cute like it. Plain button earring. One of these. Oh, I thought the stuff was missing, but I think it just has some sections of um, plain silver. A little cheaply made. That's off center. I think I have this, actually. It might be... Yes, thought so. Sarah Coventry. Eagle. That's vintage. Two-tone. Cool. Uh, let's see a tangle. Oh. I think this is one of the kind of the clips for lingerie or the stockings or something. I've seen them before, but plain, not with this kind of lace. Fancy. It's heavy, though. Can't imagine wearing that on your leg. Some, some nice glass beads. Um. Clip on pearl earring, very loose. Nice dangling cascading earring with the red stones. Maybe we'll get another one. Another pearl. Another one of these. I'm assuming these you'd have to have those padding it could be very uncomfortable. Oh. Silver tone bangles. More beads. This is, this feels like plastic with some Chinese writing. Uh, oh, 
looks like a fairy or an angel with a thread and needle. Camco. I believe that's what this is. Camco. Hmm. I haven't had one of those. Moon Glow. Screw back. Let's see the other one. I love the Moon Glow. I sold the necklace with the gray Moon Glow a long time ago. It's pretty. For some reason, I, I want to keep all of it because I like it. These look handmade with some coins from some country. I don't know. Uh, oh, the, the mm, 1950, is it Dutch? Dutch, Dutchland or something? Oh, this is the earring that's supposed to Go on the bottom here. Okay. Maybe we can reattach that. Nice cuff link. Nice and chunky. That is Breakthrough for Youth. Oh, that's the, um, is it Cub Scouts or? Something like that? I think that's the Girl Scouts or something. Pretty. Simple but pretty. Oh, here's another Sarakov. This is a pendant Got some damage there. 100% secretary? Lion. Is that the, like the American Legion or something? Cute little heart earrings. I don't know what this monstrosity is. Let's get it out of the way. Here's the other cuff link. Very chunky. This is just a big hunk of something. I'm assuming some sort of metal or plastic. Mm, I can't see what that says. Pono, made in Italy. Pono, made in Italy. Almost made in Italy. It's in good shape, but I guess it's kind of funky, abstracty. Hmm, I have to look that one up. A bangle. Uh, Schmushed. Oh, here's the other coin earring. Coins. It's like a sunburst or a flower. It's older, hence the V and the mm, pin part sticking out longer than the claspy thing. Sorry, I'm not too technical <laughs> right now. Um, it's pretty. A little more sparkle, but it's nice. It's nice. I'm not gonna complain about that. This is kind of a framed looking. I'm surprised it doesn't say Sour Coventry, but it doesn't. Just kind of, I guess, trees, leaves. Big old diamond. Got some wear. Well, here's a green earring. Pretty. For Christmas or whatever. Little flowers, cute. Where's the clasp? Oh, it's got a lot of wear. It's very loved. Oh, here's the other red one. 
I would wear those for Christmas. Here's another coin. This is heavy. 1854. I don't know if it's really a coin and it's in this thing. I don't know. I, I think it's just supposed to look like a coin, right? Not too familiar with that. Looks like something from Quaker State. Is it? It's, um, National Quality Award. Q. Or Quaker Oats, something like that. I don't know. This is tangled. But it's a big... Um, is that a, a G, an S, or A with an A and S or something? It's very heavy. And it's just attached to this. I guess maybe it was a bracelet or something, but I don't know. A keepsake of some sort. I think I should check that for gold or something. Or is that like it's just plated? Yeah, it's plated. Oh, pretty. This is a necklace. It's older. I don't know what those beads are. Oh, it's it's mother of pearl. They don't have much um, glow to them, but it's a tangle. Not a bad looking necklace with these little sections. It's pretty. It's just the mother of pearl doesn't have too much of the the parts that really give it shine. You can see a little bit of it there. Not bad. This is a horse. Oh, a unicorn. A big old flower. These are always nice to have. Oh, it's a little wiggly. I don't find too many that aren't all messed up, but this looks pretty good. It's got a scratch, but still so sunny and pretty. These green little earrings. These are pretty scuffed up. These are Monet. Um, this is a multi, multi, multi string necklace. I don't know if that's just got a scratch on it or if that's trying to say something. Oh, Japan. Yeah, it says only a little bit of it, but you can tell. It's very lightweight. These are pretty. You can wear these all the time. I don't think they ever go out of style. They're a pain to straighten out, but I think they look good with everything. Super lightweight. It's yeah, still a little bit tangled. But it's got a nice tone to it. And it's lightweight. This is a cute chain. Oh. Got the textured links. That's newer. But it's pretty, like an everyday kind of thing. Some silver tone chains. 
Mm, I don't see anything that would indicate that it was sterling. Take it easy. Um, no, just these kind that rip my hair out. A hoop earring. See anything on it? Could be sterling, but I don't see anything on it. A bango. Might as well check see if there's anything on there. Kind of cheap, I think. This is really thick. A thick link. With a lot of wear. It got a lot of love. This I saw from the outside. I thought, ooh, I like that icy blue. This looks like a pretty iceberg. They're plastic, but they're almost like a moon glow, but they've got a little bit more texture to them. Not perfectly round. It's just pretty. I love that blue. It's in good shape too. Got a little scratch, but not bad for the age. I like it's pretty. This was some kind of brooch from, let's see, I'm going to say that's AK. Mm, good for a craft pile. This is the courting couple. This is old, I would say. I really like the frame, super lightweight. This is hollow and it looks like it's painted from the back and some of the paint has come off. You can see the other side. Almost looks like a tree, like it's almost supposed to be that way, but I don't think it is. That's nice painting. I bet you that's hand done. You would th think, right? It's still really cool. Hummingbird. Seems like something was dangling, maybe was attached there, or that's just his feet. Nice enamel. A watch by Jamor. Mm -hmm. A little wear on that. I found a lot of these. The sweater clips. Oh, uh, I think this is a scarf clip. It's pretty. I think I have a brooch like that too. You, I find the weirdest, the weirdest watches. I've never, never heard of a Cumex. Cumex. Interesting. I'll go in the watch pile. Oh, it's missing some stones. Missing quite a few. Mm. Oh, it's a golf, is it a brooch, pin? Is this to hook your glasses? I'm gonna go with that. Pearls. And more pearls. Oh boy. 
these are plastic. I thought I saw clasp, yes. They're very long and they have this that says Japan. I guess, I don't know if you would call this the flapper length. This has got to be at least 30 inches long. They're plastic, but they're in nice shape. They have a nice glow to them. This is newer. Looks like um, the um, little T, their dangle. Lightweight, you know. H W H or H M H. Let's go to H M H. He's swank. H M H. That's heavy duty. There's a clip on, kind of in bad shape. Oh, this is like lucite. Well, actually, it feels like glass. I guess it was an earring. It's, if it's not glass, it's pretty heavy lucite. That's pretty. Oh, I really like that. I don't know if somebody made that. It doesn't seem homemade. It's got this that seems like it was welded on there. And then this. I guess that's Mary and the Aurora Borealis. Really pretty. It's different. I like that. Very pretty. I like that mixed mixed media type stuff. Avon. I think I have this with a blue stone. Ooh, a fish. A nice fish. I guess it would be considered a goldfish. I know it's gold, but you know what I mean. Seems like a goldfish shape. These are cute. I think it has all the stones, yeah. Ooh. This is very yucky. A fake tag. Watch, I'm just going to put it over here because yucky. It's, um... A little angel from Comex, Camex, something like that. Um, and the moon is eating his hands. Or is that a, a bowling ball with a loaded diaper? I think it's supposed to be a bowling ball, but it's odd. Little bumpy pearls. Oh, I think it's got a little rust or dirt on it. Oh, the clasp is broke. Oh, no, no, it's not broke. It's just hooks on here, right? Oh, all of a sudden I'm a rookie. I don't know what I'm talking about. These little bumpy ones. Those are classic. Whoa, look at this. That's got some wear. These have been around a while. Very chunky. I can't imagine wearing that. I mean, it's hollow, but still weedy. 
Mm. It's the only time I hope that I don't find the other one. There's a nice watch. Wittenauer. It's all broken up though. Goes in the watch pile later. Another watch. Let's see what we got. Citizen Elegance. Probably was nice when it was brand new. It's um usually from Avon, yep. First cancer awareness. A bowling turkey. Oh Chili C Sanders. Oh. I guess that's three strikes. That's cute. Oh boy. Guess what we have. Yep. It's uh, some sort of alien pod. Well, somebody liked them at one point, right? An old pearl ring. One of the pearls popped off. Actually, I need this pearl. Because I, I want to fix a necklace that I have. I don't fix too much stuff, but this necklace is so pretty. It has beautiful rhinestones, big, and pearls set like that on, on a prong. So I'm going to have to put that to the side and see if it'll work. This is... Whoa. Is this all one necklace? No. It's got this enamel swirl thing. No name on that. But it's attached to this. I think that's just one necklace and this is a pendant for some other necklace. I can't imagine this. Wait. Oh, think about it. Think about it. Yeah, glad I figured it out <laughs> before anybody else told me. There you go. Okay, I thought it was two separate necklaces. You could you could probably take this off and wear the other one. Just like uh, my nose is itchy, like that, if you wanted. Right? You could a pearl. Avon, very chunky. Oh, it's older too. It's got the hook. That's cute. Oh, friendship through bowling. Cute, cute. They're very friendly. Another one of these. Uh, whoop. This is a cute little one with some little rhinestones. A bowling turtle. He's cute. Oh, this is, oh, I thought it said chili last time. It's China. China C. Sanders. Silly. He's cute. We have to lock them all together. One of these. I find these quite often. Don't remember ever wanting to wear one. These are some beads. Bowling. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Oh, I think that's it all split, like a, a split, like 710 split, something like that. Let's move on. Okay, this is so cute. Look at that. Look how cute that is. I have a ring similar to this. Adorable. Oh my goodness. Once again, something I would go crazy over when I was a little kid. I guess I still love it. But if I was a little girl and I got this in a candy machine or something, I'd be like, oh my gosh. I'd wear it until it fell apart, probably. So cute. Well, on that note, I'm going to wrap it up. Thanks for watching, guys. Thanks always for your support and your comments and positivity. I really appreciate it. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe and hit the button so you know when I'm going to make another video. And um, have a great day. Thanks. Bye.